Hi friends, welcome back to Arc Tutorials. This is Bootstrap 5 full tutorial playlist. Today's episode, we are going to learn and implement Bootstrap Collapse. You would have seen this functionality when you are implementing CSS styles, especially display none and display block. So basically what we are doing is toggling the elements visibility and either we are showing it or hiding it. right? Uh, you would have used it in jQuery as well like dot .hide, dot .show. Similarly, Bootstrap provides utility class called Collapse and we can attach an event using a button and say data toggle and we can bind it and say Collapse by passing an ID. Let's learn all about it in today's episode. Extremely important to kind of enhance the user experience uh, overall. This is part 19 of Bootstrap 5 full tutorial playlist. The playlist link is in the description box below. Make sure you check it out. Um, I've planned around 40 tutorials for you, including live projects and examples. So, so far uh, we have covered about the grids. The, so we did some live projects on grid layouts. We learned about navbar, card, list, tables, button groups. We did some more live projects, alerts, model window, and today we are learning about bootstrap collapse right so like i said um, bootstrap provides us with a class uh, called class equal to collapse and we can give an id right collapse example and data toggle is equal to collapse and data target equal to the id of the element that you want to hide or show right so these are the things uh, it's extremely you can you can play it with different um, variations like accordion or hide or show or notification etc let's see some in action and by doing some hands on activity all right so what i am going to do let me first show you the application so this is the application we have so far um, so we have a, a messaging we can click it we create we learned about bootstrap model in the last window and now what we are going to do is we'll implement click on these particular metrics and there should be some small message which should come up with some details for them right to add interactivity so let's do that so what i'm going to do i'm going to add to the buttons right so i'm going to make this entire thing a button right uh, or say we can add a button uh, HR class equal to btn button link say click no more right so something like or no more right or say show more right so and here i'm giving data toggle equal to collapse and i'm saying data so we have to pass the target right so what we'll do is data target equal to id of that right so which id so here i will say i can show spending right so that's one of the things that we'll give and so we have to create a div for it with the same id so at the end I, what i will do i will create a div and call it collapse and give an id and it, this should be the same as the one that we gave there so i'll say show spending okay this is div for showing spending summary all righty now let's click you see this now if you don't have this you see this now what i'm going to do is i'm going to wrap it pg link padding should be four okay so let's close this messaging click here this is showing right so this is for the first one similarly what we can do is we'll copy the uh, this warning is too jazzy too big oh this is too bright <laughs> okay let's keep it simple mm not bg light okay so this looks good this looks much better right so it comes up here right so there is a background um, all right um, so cool uh, so let's copy this 
couple of times like one two three four and say this is show cost uh, and show this month show next month right now similarly the way we included this link right so we will include it in each of this and just change the name show cost show this month so design only takes time uh, because you have to spend time making it perfect right and that's the thing that you have to keep right so we have now four links now what I'm going to do is to just to show you that it's different different I'm going to give different different colors again it's up to you whether to use the same colors or different but right, right so you have the warning here in gray then Right. then you have div which shows and spending so it will make it success it will make it danger right so close it here now green opens up green yellow opens up yellow right so you have these um, again you can customize the text colors for this right text white like this text white right this is black again you can show here white right now this is one variation of a collapse right where you can show all four divs but there is also variations that you can use which is like the accordions right so when you click on one it should open up other Right. so you can use them as an accordion also right so we can use this also I mean have the each of this in the card and then use the buttons to give that particular like you open one and hide others right so I will give you this uh, as an homework give it a try it's just copy this code and put it in this cards and you should be able to get it uh, simply right so give it a try I will show you how to do that maybe later in the ex example but you get an idea of how to use the collapse uh, component in bootstrap right so use this as an accordion try and show only one div at a time if you want you can just refer to this particular code and this should help you move forward if you have any doubts let me know I'll be happy to help you thank you so much see you in the next episode we will cover bootstrap forms extremely important no application is complete without forms we'll see that in the next video thank you so much for joining see you in the next episode